Okay, welcome back. In this video, I'm going to show you how to insert a YouTube video or any video really um, that you want to spin and put onto your posts or pages. So, uh, yeah, basically, uh, if you've got a page or a post, article, whatever, and we were working on this one before, what makes a, a great house painting contractor? Uh, I showed you how you can set up the images to um, to spin them every time uh, we. Um, we have a spin and uh, now what I'm going to do is show you, show you how to put a video in here uh, sizing is up to you um, but um, not only a video but uh, show you how to put in we're going to do three different videos and put them in, in the spinner in the syntax spinner and uh, have them rotate at random when we do the spin and uh, basically all you got to do is to um, get your embed code from wherever it is YouTube or Vimeo or wherever you can even uh, have these hosted on site and use a WordPress plugin if you wish um, more on that a little bit later on but uh, here I am on YouTube and all I've done is I've uh, because the article is about painting I've just clicked on any any uh, video here about painting got this first one here and uh, of course where it says share you just click on share and uh, you get the embed code now you can use the uh, full embed code if you want the old embed code um, it just depends on how you want to set it up uh, whether you want to have it with autoplay or whether you want to have it uh, privacy enhanced uh, recommended videos at the end etc etc it depends on whether it's coming off your channel or somebody else's I guess um, in this case we're just going to use the standard iframe uh, code so what, what I do is I just go here and I right click and I copy that and I've prepared earlier on what I've done is I've come in and I've pasted in one, two, three. So this, this represents three different videos here. So I've got them on my um, on my uh, notepad. And what I'm going to do now is to go to the post itself. And this is the um, the uh, WP Auto Spin Syntax Editor that we've got down here. You can see there's the three images that we, we uh, put in earlier in the previous video for spinning. And uh, what I'm going to do is pick a spot where I want the video to show up so um, and you can have more than one video showing up um, provided you don't have them set to autoplay but uh, we're just going to go for one but we're going to have uh, various videos uh, rotate so to do that again we're going to say put them in here so that's where we'll go we open up the syntax um, uh, characters with the uh, opening curly bracket so we'll put in video one Okay, we'll separate it with the vertical pipe. Video 2, these are just the placeholders separated with the vertical pipe. Video 3, because we've got three of them that we're going to put in. Okay, and close it off with the curly bracket. Okay, now rather than paste the code in here, which is the visual mode, I recommend you go to text uh, mode and just scroll down. And they're pretty easy to find, as you will soon see. Here we, we've got them down here, okay. Video 1, video 2, video 3. So what I'm going to do is going to go to my code here and the first one I'm going to whack in is this one here um, and we're going to say put that in exactly where it says video 1 okay without going over the the uh, curly bracket or the vertical pipe and we're going to paste that in okay so that's in there okay we go back here to our notepad and we get the second bit of code and we right click we copy that we come back here and where it says video 2 we just select the text that says video 2 I'm doing control V paste here and the third and final one we're going to put in is here okay and we're going to copy and we're going to go video 3 okay got it control V paste it in okay and now what we're going to do is spin it Okay, so we spin, that'll save it at the same time. And uh, when we go up here to the main uh, editor, we'll just go in visual mode, you'll see that a video has been placed in place there. And we're going to go to the page itself. And if that's been done correctly, this video will disappear. And a new one in its place. Okay, so there's the spin. And there's the new video. So we've got the... Uh, the title spun, spun, the image spun, the text spun, and the video spun. And uh, let's just go back and see if we can get it to change again. This is 
under a random uh, schedule of course uh, or random coding so uh, sometimes the video changes sometimes it doesn't we've got three there rotating and uh, let's just refresh the page again and see if it changed uh, same guy again okay so when we do another spin okay let's see if it changes this time okay we'll go back and we will refresh the page as soon as it's finished saving now okay okay yep there we go that's the third video so the first one we had was the guy spray painting the garage door the second one talking about the the equipment and uh, the third one the, uh, the 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 front door so um, yeah you can uh, that's basically the way this done you can as I said before you can uh, have uh, whatever um, embed code you want to use the uh, the old form code or the new iframe style you can have Vimeo daily motion whatever you're going to have you can have it privately hosted or using a WordPress plugin and the same principle applies that uh, the way that or the method that you would normally use to embed your video in a page or a post you go exactly the same route uh, with the, with this but you just use the um, the video one video two video three video four how many are you going to have separated by the uh, by the um, uh, vertical pipes within the curly brackets okay so that's basically how it's done though guys I uh, hope you've enjoyed the video uh, if you've got any questions you can uh, submit them to us um, send a support ticket or send us an email um, thanks for your company on this video look forward to seeing you in the next one bye now